So, welcome to my channel. Uh, as you can probably tell, my name is Oliver, uh, as that is the channel name. It's the one I've decided to go with. Couldn't think of anything inspirational, didn't want to do any weird, dumb names, so Oliver it is. Um, so what this channel will be is a robotics channel. So I just finished my three-year course in robotics at Middlesex University, which is great fun. Uh, you can actually see a couple of uh, the work that I've done there below, I know there's like four videos or so of like little bits that I've done using UR10 robot arms, ABB uh, manufacturing arms with like pens added onto them. So there's a couple little videos and I think a self-balancing robot that me and a partner developed. Um, so what I'm going to be doing on this channel is I'm going to be taking from the knowledge that I hopefully learnt at university and I'm going to be producing some projects and seeing what I can do really. Um, I think one of the first ones I want to try and tackle would be like a fun automation one where I can say to like an Alexa, I'd be like make me cereal and a bowl will just sort of land under some sort of hopper, it'll open up, drop some cereal in and then pour some milk in. Just sounds like a fun thing and I'm thinking I might uh, do a series where I basically go through my day and automate different pieces. Uh, from that though, I will also be doing other things, that's why I didn't really want to call it a robotics channel because I might do electronics projects like, um, I don't know, building a Tesla coil, just anything that I would consider fun. Uh, currently, setup's horrible. You are on a camera, uh, it's a Canon 600D, I've got a Yeti microphone here, that's going to be great for the audio I'm sure, grabbing that, um, and then I've just... I'm just sort of working with this for now in a very small room. You're sat on my bed, like the extent of my room is to here. This is what I've got as space for now, but I'm moving soon and I'll hopefully have more room. And then what I'll be doing in the new room is I'll actually be developing an electronics workshop and a 3D printing workshop for myself. So that's one of the processes I'll take this channel through as well, which will be looking for a viable 3D printer, which can give me a good print bed size and good quality prints at the same time. I may even look into a series where I adapt that printer and take maybe a, a weaker printer and make it into more of an efficient, better printer. That might be a plan that I want to do. Uh, so the next episode will actually be looking into a 3D printer because that is exactly what I need to get started realistically with a couple of the projects that I'm looking at. Um, so we'll be taking through that whole process uh, from start to finish. So if you want to follow along, I'll leave like links in the description and stuff to be able to sort of grab the pieces that I grab. And then there might be longer videos that are actual tutorials on like the build process. And there'll be shorter ones where it's just me doing like clap cuts and all sorts if I can get any sort of video editing prowess but currently zero. I've done a test recording, I managed to sync the audio. That's all I need. Um, so yeah that's the plan really. Uh, this is the first video because if I have one I may as well make more. That's my theory at least and I'm hoping that this will really push me to keep going so if you keep looking out there'll be another one coming out soon that has uh, a video it'll be mostly I'll try and do a face recording while doing googling but my setup is here like I've got my monitor and I would be typing here so you'd sort of be looking at me I've, as I'm saying it I feel like I can make it work so we'll give it a go but um that would require more editing that I know how to do I've got people though people will tell me things I think hopefully um, and yeah, so that's the plan. I'm just going to keep developing this as I go. If there's any projects that you guys want to see me do or anything you want to see me try and tackle, I can give it a go. I'm not going to say I'm the best at things, but I'm not the worst. But I just thought, considering I finished my university uh, three years now, I finished all of that, finished my projects for that, and there's a bit of a thing going on outside. I've got no job currently because of things. And I have, I've literally just finished uni, so I haven't gone into a graduate job. So I thought, I'll just start this, see how it goes, do some stuff, make things. And that's the plan, really. I don't think there's going to be much um, coordination at the start. There won't be like a real set schedule because it'll just take time to gather certain things. I'm going to try and keep it to maybe like a video every two weeks of doing stuff. So like... The first one will start soon with the looking for the 3D printer and it's just going to sort of be uh, explaining what I'm after. I've got a big whiteboard. I might do some drawings of things that I need and sort of talk things through and how things work and maybe 
if it's required, I can do a sort of small talk through and breakdown of how a 3D printer works. But otherwise, yeah, that's the plan. So thank you for joining and I will see you soon, I guess.